this is a continuation of the first dub. If you it, please watch it before you watch this one. That is all. Perhaps? <sighs> Bro, I no sons. You don't have to talk about it if you don't want to. Thank you. Thank you. Sons, uh, maybe until these nightmares blow over, you can stay in my room with me. You did really well last night. <laughs> nah, I like the couch. And I, I'm gonna head to Grubby's. You don't have to talk about it, but don't run. Please. You can join me in the human sleepover. Maybe it will help. The Pyrus, the kiddo, is sleeping in your room tonight? Yeah, remember? I chased after the human and had to fight them. But during the fight, they started flirting with me. So we dropped the whole thing and went on a date. But I realized during the date, I simply did not have such feelings for the human. By then, as I was getting kind of late, the human tried to stay at the end, but apparently, it was too noisy. So they came back, and you read as part of a, my favorite bedtime story. Yeah. Oh, that's right, Pops. You know, maybe instead of Groobies, we can finish that story together. Sons, I would love that, but you don't have to. Really, not after what you went through. No. I think this will help me feel better, too. I... Oh, human! I told you to stay upstairs. Oh, uh, hi, kid. Oh, no. Did I scare you? I'm sorry. <laughs> uh? Kid, I'm okay. You don't need to cry. Everything is alright. Come on, I'm gonna carry you up the bed. Up we go. Wow. So, the fluffy bunny really liked his friends. So, the fluffy bunny wanted to have a party. But he didn't have any carrots to make. He didn't have enough carrots. I mean, eh. So, he got some carrots from the store. So he can make a carrot cake. But to make the cake, he need flour. And then, the fluffy bunny was no longer sad that his cake had gotten eaten almost completely by his friends. But then he realized they were just trying to be nice to him and save him the biggest piece of all. And then the fluffy bunny is no longer sad. The end. Oh, that ending always. Oh, that ending always gets me. Thank you, brother. Yep. Hey, if you hey if you want, we can try to make a spot for you on the bed. Nah, you can. You know I can sleep anywhere. Here's fun. Just get a good rest, bro. Oh, alright, if you're sure. Have a great sleep, brother. <laughs> you too. Uh. Oh. <sighs> mm. oh. <sighs> After a tale. Part. Two. Nya, 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 nya. Sons, you, you're awake before me. <laughs> Morning, bro. Wait, Sons, you didn't sleep at all. Sons, it looks almost as if you were staying up on purpose to protect me from some unseen possibility possibly imaginary threat? Uh, 
but that's silly. You have no line, the stronger brother. I protect you. <laughs> okay. I'm fine with that. <laughs> Whoopee cushions in your coat. I can't believe you'd start this early. I don't know. I thought it was a breath of fresh air. No! Come on, Pabs. I think you need to take all that pent up rage and just release it. You're literally the worst ever. Move on ahead, kid. I gotta change my jacket. See you for breakfast. Be right down. <laughs> Honestly, sons, either way, the human told me something. After breakfast, they're going to leave. They're very determined to get home, apparently. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It makes me feel very conflicted. Human, I think I I would miss you having you around. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't think the kid feels too well, well. Hmm? Human, what are... <gasps> you spit out my delicious spaghettis, just so you could give me such a wonderful massage. Oh, I'll be looking around to... I'll be looking forward to each and every visit. Hashtag sorry for my mistakes, bruh. Dress. Yes. Frisk, dressed in their normal clothes. Waterfall is much warmer than hair, so your outfit should be fine. Oh, I hope you'll come back often. You become such a good friend. Hey, kiddo, after my nap, I'll come find you. You can grab rubies, okay? Mm. You thumbs up the sons, because he is great and cool and a very punny person, but you don't say it out loud. Because then Papyrus will get upset, and you don't want to do that. Maybe Undyne will go easy on them? Fear not, sons. I will simply tell Undyne the human is wearing an old tutu. The human would never be caught dead in such a thing. Little does he know I caught the human wearing that earlier. Eh, whatever. <laughs> You're the smartest scale ever. Um, so, Sans, now that we're alone, I wanted to say something. Hmm? Bro? Okay. It has to do with all your recent nightmares. Uh, bro, you don't, you told me I didn't have to talk about it. Oh, and you still don't, if you don't want to. I just, sons, I know you're, you better than anyone, but I also know you tend to, well, you don't tell me much, sons. I can't tell you, I can tell you hide a lot from me, a lot about you, and I also know that you probably believe you're protecting me by pushing me away, but sons, I'm an adult, and I'm most dedicated, and a most dedicated brother and friend. And I can handle it. No, I want to handle it. Side by side. By you. I'm with you. Burns just way less that way. For both of us. I think. So anyway. And maybe you'd feel just a little bit better? Pups? Yes, brother? I... No, I felt myself die. I felt myself turn to dust. Wait, you what? Yeah, it was real. Very, very real. It was like another lifetime. It wasn't the only one who died. I wasn't, I meant to say, but I'm not gonna.
to say. I only saw bits and pieces, but I felt the rest. In my dream, I watched Undyne leave to fight, but I knew. No, we both knew she was walking to her death. And I know monsters were dying. Everyone was dying. And Papyrus. Papyrus. No. Never. I won't let myself see it happen. I can't. I couldn't handle it. How did I handle it, then? Why did I make myself watch the recordings of Snowden? Okay, sons. Okay. It's okay. You don't have to keep, keep going. You're okay. Everyone is okay. Everyone is okay. <sighs> You're right. I feel the coolest, bro. Well, brother, under normal circumstances, I would agree. Right now, however... Huh? What the? I am in the presence of the true Krolis, brother. Krolis. Bro, what? That's right. I don't care who knows. Like you, random person. Uh, what? what are you talking about? Looking for an awesome new brother? Well, too bad. Sans here is already taken. What? <laughs> Perhaps no. You too. My brother is all mine. What? Yo, what you talking about? I only like Undyne. Hey, you! Bro, I swear. I don't know if I love you or hate you right now. What's a silly thing to say, Sans? Crud. Okay, hold on, just pretend I didn't mess up there. Hey, you! Hey, you! Bro, I swear, I don't know if I love you or hate you right now. That's a silly thing to say, Sans. You couldn't ever hate me. <sighs> Sans? <sighs> oh, right. You're, you've had pretty much zero hours of sleep. Okay, okay. Let's get you home, Sleepy Bones. Yo, do you know what he was talking about? Mm, no. <laughs> so, pups. Sons, you're awake. And no nightmares. Yeah, looks like it. Oh, the TV. Sorry, bro. I didn't. Mean to bone it. What? Don't be ridiculous, Sans. Besides, the sand still works great. So I can get to hear my sexy rectangle at least. S sexy rectangle? Uh, where exactly did you hear that word? Also, I'm pretty sure medicine is a square. Oh, remember? We were talking about the box of pasta. No, not a rectangle. The word sexy. Oh, Alfie told me that one. She goes on dine and meditate on that all the time. She told me it's like a really nice compliment. Compliment. Ah, Rick. Hold on. Hold on. Having some problems here. She did know. Huh? Yep. So I've been using it for everyone I care about. And I, Alfie, sounds even. Stop, this is making me uncomfortable. Uh, I mean, Papyrus. I'm sure she didn't know any better, but I have to tell you. It might be different in Hotland, but Ron Sun, that is a very bad word. Huh? Yeah. And if you want to see the rest of this comic, you'll have to rewatch it. You'll have to watch the rest of it. Because I'm running out of recording space. So, come back again to watch the rest of this video. I'm in this comic. Comic series with me while I record it and do dubbing because awesomeness. Okay, stop me now before I run out of 50 minutes.